Hello there, my name is Caroline O'Connor and I'm playing the role of Reno Sweeney in Anything Goes. We were saying to some of the other cast members before, you don't get more classic American Broadway musical than, uh, than Anything Goes. What's, what does it mean to be a part of uh, the revived Australian production? Oh, you know, it's incredible because also for many, many years I've had friends and colleagues and agents and people say to me, you know, you really should do Anything Goes. And I don't know whether they think I'm going to sort of raise the money and put it on myself. <laughs> I thought, you know, these things just come around. Shows, you can never predict when someone's going to produce a show. So I always hoped and dreamed and thought, oh, in my bucket list, definitely Reno Sweeney is in there and Anything Goes. Mm. And then, amazing. That's, um, you know, John rang me and said, look, I, I think about doing this show. And of course, at the media release today, he said it did take some time to get all the ingredients to come together, all the elements. So it was about two and a half years. And uh, today, here I am at the media call. And I can believe now that it's actually really <laughs> going to happen. And I'm terribly, terribly excited. Do you remember when you were first exposed to the music? Obviously, the music of Cole Porter is, is so ingrained. In yeah, well, you know what? I People know, everyone knows that I'm like the biggest Ethel Merman fan of all time. So anything that she sang or in any film that she was ever in or recording, I've heard them all. And so, of course, she created this role. Mm. And, um, yeah, I, I, I also am a big Cole Porter fan as well. It's just how clever he is, how, mm. how fun the lyrics are. And this is the kind of score that when you're in the audience, I think most people, you can't help yourself but be toe tapping or wanting to sing along because even though the songs are from a score, they're also very familiar. They're like very familiar standards that people, great singers used to sing over the years. But then when you see them in the show, in the plot, you think, wow, oh my God, who would have thought you know, that it works so brilliantly? Like you just think they're a great song. So yeah, it's, it's got everything and, and just when I thought it was safe to put my dancing shoes away and, you know, have to drag out those tap shoes again. And it happened, you know, last year or the 2013 when I did the Tony Awards. And it was like, I hadn't tapped since 1984. So I'm kind of excited about that as well. And, you know, Todd can give me a few tips on that because he hasn't stopped tapping. He taps the Morse code. Uh, yeah, it's, it's one of those shows that I just, I can't believe my luck that I'm actually getting to do it. And you mentioned the Tonys as well. That that was a must have been another pinch yourself moment. Our business is like that, you mm. know. Um, it's like uh, what pleasures life delivers are never the expected ones. And that was in a, a line from a play I did years ago, and it couldn't be truer. That uh, you, you know you can hope and dream and wish and think you know this was this is what I want to do or this is the path that I'm going to go down. I really didn't think I would get the chance to perform at the Tony Awards, never mind Radio City Music Hall. So, and to get to do it at that age, I'm not going to say my age, but I, I probably have said it previously. <laughs> but it was really like, oh my God. And not as nerve wracking as I thought it would be. Mm. On the rehearsal, yes, but on the night, absolutely thrilling. Well, we can't wait to see you back, back on Australian stages. I'm and, here, I'm home. And the Opera House, no less. I know, and that's an old stomping ground for me. I've done a lot of things at the Opera House. The opening of the Opera House, mm. I've done my own show there in the concert hall. I did End of the Rainbow there. A lot of concerts, uh, you know, with the ballet. It's like, I just love that place. I, I want an apartment inside the Opera House. I just want to live there, <laughs> doesn't everybody? That would be amazing. Well, I look forward to everyone coming to see the show, and I, I really hope they're going to enjoy it. I think you're really going to get your money's worth because it's, got, it's got, just got everything. Fantastic. Thank you so much, Caroline.